down with the sickness. Get up, come on, get down with the sickness. Get up, come on, get down with the sickness. Open up your head and let it flow into me. Morning, Mavericks. Today is Friday, May 4th. I'm Brady. And I'm Josie, here with your Mad Vision News. Senior pages are due at 11.59 p.m. in Tarit Squared. If you want to qualify for a graduation cord, no exceptions. If you need assistance, please stop by the MAV Library and speak with Mrs. Watico. Seniors who have been impacted by Hurricane Harvey need to see Ms. Hendricks in the library for an application for a $20,000 scholarship. They may also find the application in file 43 in the scholarship box in the library's College and Career Center. All library materials are due by May 11th for seniors and May 23rd for 9th through 11th graders. The Tennis Challenge and Fundraiser will be May 14th through May 16th. So get your team together and practice after school with your partner. Thursday, May 17th is a teacher-student tournament after school. On Friday, May 18th is the student-student student tournament after school. Finally, Saturday, May 19th is the car wash at Pet Boys across from Walmart from 8 a.m. to 2 p.m. It's coming to a close for our seniors, and they are recognized this week at Senior Awards. We'd also like to recognize and thank Mr. King Fernandez, Pasadena ISD Board of Trustees member. How do you feel getting the Judy Kello Outstanding Government Student Award? It's a great honor um, receiving this award. It's great to receive the recognition and the support of faculty as we go off to college and major in government. And um, we, we hope to plan careers in politics, whether it be local or federal. How do you feel getting the Triple Crown Award? I mean, really, it feels really great um, having this honor uh, to receive this award. Um, I don't know, it just makes me very happy that I've been nervous for the things that I've done in this the awards that I received were the Academic Excellence Award and the Triple Crown Award. I'm extremely proud to receive those awards, especially from the school, and I'm really excited about it. I got the Academic something, the UIO, the Presidents, one more, and then the Triple Crown Award. It felt mad cool actually to get an award, you know, to say that I spent three years here and they actually meant something, like they built up to this moment right here. The award that I won was the Academic Excellence Award, and I felt like I deserved this award because over the past four years, my scholarly like introduction has been nice, and I delivered everything well. I've been nice to the teachers. Stand up, CJ. You know, like it's just I've been working hard out here. You know, like I've been putting in these hours. You did. So I got the Presidential Scholar Award, the AP Scholar Award the UIL Scholar Award, um, Outstanding Math Student, and the Volunteer Bronze Level, along with a scholarship for $30,000. And I just feel really proud of my achievements, and I'm happy that I was recognized for them among all my peers and everybody else who did really well. So my advice to the underclassmen or anybody who's trying to achieve these goals, just stay focused, um, reach out to people who are able to help you, and just be determined and know what you want. Congratulations to Memorial Teacher of the Year and New Teacher of the Year. It seems that we have a bit of an issue. That Miss Gamble's class does not know that she is the 2017-18 Teacher of the Year for Bad Hair. But even more importantly, what a wonderful person, how caring she is, not only for her students, but for her colleagues as well. Well, I think that we have many teachers that are worthy of the honor of being named Teacher of the Year at Pasadena Memorial High School on any given school year. But uh, some of the characteristics that make Ms. Gamble special are uh, her servant spirit. She's willing to do anything and everything to help her students be successful. And not only that, but her colleagues as well. She's always willing to go the extra mile and to do whatever it takes to make those around her successful. And we just wanted to take note of that this year 
and let her know that she's an outstanding educator. She makes a true difference in the lives of her students and that we, we love her and we care about her very much and we want to say congratulations, Miss Gamble, for being named the Pasadena Memorial Teacher of the Year. I think she won because she's one of the sweetest teachers I know and um, she's very selfless and she puts herself, she puts her students before herself and she's just a really caring teacher and I love Ms. Campbell. It feels exciting and just, I just feel so blessed and thank you so much to everyone. I've had wonderful mentors and I can't thank you enough. My favorite thing about teaching is seeing the eyes and the minds working and the children and the students that I teach every day. Every day is a new day here at Memorial and I just love it. Thank you. It appears that we've got an issue. You all and your teacher are unaware that Ms. Hernandez has been named the Pasadena Memorial High School New Teacher of the Year. come by and congratulate her in person, let you all know, but you know this already, that she is a wonderful teacher. It was really fun. It was so much fun. My kids are, I'm going to tear up because I'm talking about my kids, but my kids are awesome and they're hilarious and they make every day the best day ever. When I was in college, I wasn't sure that I wanted to teach. Um, and so then, you know, getting my classroom together and having my first year, it just solidified that this is, this is what I want to do for the rest of my life. Hey guys, we're from, from the Memorial Tennis Team. I'm Evie the President. I'm Olivia Vice President. And I'm Kirsten the Treasurer. Do you want bragging rights? Do you want to win medals? Sign up for the Memorial Maverick Tennis Challenge. Find a teacher, find a student partner, and it's $5 per team. If you're a teacher and you want to play against another teacher and another student, come out May 17th. And if you're a student playing with another student, come out May 18th. Sign up with us! Here's highlights from the student teacher soccer event. Bean and he says, I feel like there's gonna be a bad case of the flu hitting seniors on Monday. If you'd like to be the tweet of the day, follow us at PMHS underscore Mavision. That's all we have for you today, Mavs. May the fourth be with you on National Star Wars Day. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>